When it comes to roads, some are the city's responsibility and some are TxDOT's responsibility. That includes the Highway 281 bridge here. So the city tells me they're in constant communication with TxDOT to make sure main corridors like this one stay open and clear. Waking up to a wintry chill. How has the roads been so far? I haven't slipped yet. Crews kept busy Tuesday to keep the roads clear for travelers. This morning we did have some local bridges that were uh, had some ice on them and our public works crews treated those. We checked in with Marble Falls Fire Chief and Emergency Management Coordinator Russell Sander this afternoon after he met with city leaders for a status update. The situations are things are holding up well. Um, in the city of Marble Falls, we are encouraging our residents and those to please stay home, uh, stay off the roadways. It so far, so good, he says, but they need your help as they keep an eye on areas of concern like bridges and some of their steeper streets. We are prepared to monitor those overnight and take care of those uh, as needed. In the meantime, Hunter Wheeler is monitoring his homes in Austin and Marble Falls. Yeah, we've been dripping fa faucets uh, or different houses, just making sure you know, we don't have any pipe busts. Not a fan of the cold, and after a long day of driving from one city to the other. We're going to hunker down. I'm sick of it. It's kind of uh, hard to be productive in this weather. And the Marble Falls Police Department has been great at posting updates on road conditions throughout the day. And if you're driving in other parts of Central Texas, you can go to drivetexas.org. Reporting in Marble Falls, Carissa Lemko, Fox 7 Austin News.